Hi, I'm John Sievert, and I'm the owner of BodyLogic Physical Therapy. Today, what I want to talk to you about is a couple of ways of how to do traction. Traction is a wonderful technique that we use in physical therapy to unload pain-sensitive structures and get you out of pain. I'm going to show you a few ways of doing traction to the lumbar spine and to the cervical spine. So the first thing we're going to do is show you how to get out of pain for your low back. You're going to lie between the doorway with a simple dowel. This is just a closet dowel. It could be an old broken shovel handle, a broom handle. You're going to put it between the doorway, lie on your back, and you may start off with your legs down flat. And you got a pillow for comfort, and you're on the carpeted floor. Go ahead and push into that dowel a little bit. Yeah, so your elbows kind of lock out, maybe scoot up a little bit. Yeah, right there. You see that? Did you feel that pull? That's lumbar traction. You're getting to the lumbar spine right now. You're separating those vertebrae. And then relax. And again. So just by you just gently locking your elbows out and pushing into the stick, you're getting traction. You may go 30 seconds on, 5 seconds off, 30 seconds on. This, what we call intermittent lumbar traction, is enough to ease those symptoms that are going down your leg. Now, if this doesn't feel right, doesn't give you a good relief, you may then try, this would be the first thing to try, is with your knees bent. So go ahead and bend your knees. And now what you've just done is you've flattened your lumbar spine. And now when you push, you've kind of got changed the coefficient of friction, so you may slip a little bit easier. But if you just push just gentle enough to get a little bit of traction, you feel the back stretching, and then on and off, that's a beautiful traction. Uh-huh. Now, let's say that still doesn't give you the relief you're looking for. Go ahead and straighten your legs out again, but this time cross your left leg over your right and give it a push. Left leg over the right may put a little bit more traction on the right leg. So your right side sacroiliac joint is on contact with the floor, getting a good pull so the purchase is more on the right side. And then switching the other side looks like this. There is no right or wrong way to do lumbar traction. And you may only be here for about three to five minutes, seeing if it gives you some relief. So what the lumbar traction looks like at the spinal level is something like this. The sacrum is on the ground, and the patient is lying between the doorway. And when they push into the doorway, it provides an unloading or a separation of the lumbar vertebrae. And you can see as you push into the doorway, this type of thing is happening. So every pain-sensitive structure gets a position of being unloaded or tractioned. And that's what the traction is happening at the spinal level. There you have it. You've now seen how to do low back traction to ease any of the symptoms that you have in your back, your buttocks, down your leg, any pins and needles.